So what we're going to show today is typical office usage with single number reach. So I'm on the phone with my good friend Jerry here, and uh, I want to take this call outside because he tends to talk a long time. So let me go ahead and move this over. So what I'm going to hit is a soft key here called mobility. So I hit the mobility soft key. You'll notice it says send mobile, send call to mobile. So I'm going to go ahead and hit select. Now if we look at my mobile device, notice I'm still on the phone call with him. I get this incoming call. As soon as I answer that, this call is going to go to a shared line in use status because I've actually transferred the media over to my desk, over to my mobile phone. So here I am talking to Jerry. You there? Okay, he's there. So we've moved the call over seamlessly. He didn't hear anything. He doesn't even know what happened really, except that maybe my call got a little bit louder. So let me go ahead and transfer it back. All I did was hang up. Just hang up the call. You notice it's right here. Hit resume. Jerry, you there? Oh, yeah? Sounds a lot better, huh? All right, there it is. I'm back on the phone call with him. So that's how easy it is. Back and forth, you're on the call, nobody even knows it. We have a device that's called a remote destination profile. The remote destination profile is actually linked to your user phone number. So we, let's say we have 5052. So this is the directory number here that is going to link this person's desk phone, which has extension 5052 on it, with this person's remote destination profile. That remote destination profile is actually linked to my mobile number. And if I look out here a little bit, I have a mobile communicator device with single number reach enabled on it. This is this device here. This representation is all configured inside Communications Manager. So we have a device for your desk phone, and we have a device for your remote destination, which is your mobile device. So now when I have this incoming call come in, call comes in from the PSTN, rings this device here, it's going to ring this virtual device here as well. Now when this device is rings, this mobility number, this, your mobile number is actually activated, and we're going to initiate another call outbound to the PSTN out to your mobile device. So now I have your desk phone ringing and I have your mobile device ringing at the same time. So that's why we call it single number reach. When you answer on your mobile device, we take down the signaling, the ring signaling here, but we maintain the shared line and use uh, icon on the device because that device literally is a shared line in use. And that's how we've architected it. So you could have up to 10 of these devices spread anywhere and get ringing on all of them at the same time. Now, if I want to move the call back and forth, all I'm doing is hitting the mobility soft key here. When I press that key, it's actually going to go back and find what is my mobile number that's configured and initiate that call outbound. So when I answer here, it does the exact same thing. Stops signaling here, stops media, and converts it right on the gateway here. So basically, uh, what we've done is we've moved all this native into call manager here, into communications manager. So you, all you need is communications manager, a desk phone, potentially. You don't have to have a desk phone. So actually, if you have a sales force and you want to integrate them tightly into your uh, dial plan, you can simply give them remote destination profiles and then, of course, a mobile, a mobile device. So very simple, very easy to deploy. It's a quick way to get mobility out to your entire sales force.